In hot days like today, nothing is more valuable than a properly working air conditioner. KCAL 9's Joe Kwan shows us how to keep our AC units up and running, especially when it matters most. Alex Seedman woke up this morning to 90 degree heat inside his apartment here in West Hollywood. The bed was completely like drenched in sweat and so gross. He had plans to sleep in today on his day off. I tried to sleep through it. I tried to like ignore the fact that I was like sweating. But Alex reached his uh, boiling point, got up and figured out his AC was busted. Penny was not happy about it. My like poor dog is like <laughs> glaring at me. Over in Arcadia, Ed Ray also woke up to a hot house. Yeah, the heat woke us up. This morning, just outside his house, this thermostat kept going up and up and up. He called up air tech heating and air conditioning. They sent a guy out here within an hour or two and they diagnosed it as the fuse is being blown. Manager Rod Rodriguez says the most common AC call is for dirty filters. We uh, highly recommend to change your filter um, every three months. A clogged drain pipe is another usual suspect for AC issues. Another common problem is dirty coils in your outdoor unit. So right now we're just giving it a little bath. I'll leave it to the professionals. The pros won't be able to get to Alex and Penny's place until tonight to fix the AC. Alex says he's thankful for this temporary AC unit that he was provided. But it pumps air from the outside, so it's like pumping the 114 degree air in here. It's not really helping. And it's not helping Penny. Alex says his dog normally likes to burrow under blankets, but has had to change her ways to keep cool. She's like trying to figure out her place in this world, in this new hot world. <laughs> Alex is doing what he can to help. In West Hollywood, Joe Kwan, KCAL 9 News.